गाइस दिस इज डॉक्टर संगीता वेलकम बैक टू अनदर लेक्चर ऑफ डेंटल पार्शल एंड टुडे टॉपिक इज द ब्रॉचेस नाउ ब्रॉचेस वी हैव टू टाइप ऑफ ब्रॉचेस वी हैव बाब्ड ब्रॉचेस एंड वी हैव स्मूथ ब्रॉचेस बाब्ड ब्रॉचेस आर लाइक द बाब्ड वायर हैव यू सीन द बाब्ड वायर व्हिच आर ऑन द बॉर्डर्स सो दीज आर लाइक तारें जो जिन पे ऐसे कांटे होते हैं कैन यू सी कैन यू रिमेंबर दीज बाब्ड वायर सो दीज आर लाइक वायर विथ द शार्प एजेस और द पॉइंट्स विच आर अरेंज्ड एट द इंटरवल सो दीज आर लाइक फेंसेस सो दीज बाब्ड ब्रॉचेस सो वी हैव फाइल्स विच आर लाइक दीज बाब सो वी हैव स्पाइक्स ऑन द फाइल्स आल्सो सो वी हैव टू काइंड्स ऑफ ब्रॉचेस विच आर द बाब्ड ब्रॉचेस एंड वन विद द स्मूथ ब्रॉचेस विदाउट एनी बाब्स सो लेट्स जंप ऑन टू द बाब्ड ब्रॉचेस before we get started make sure you subscribe to our channel and click on the bell icon that way you get a notification as soon as i release a video lecture on you know, talking about the brooches brooches are the instrument which are made up of again from the stainless steel wire and there is a round stainless steel wire with some blades to form the sharp projecting like barbs so i if we talk about the barbed brooches they have a sharp projections can you see this sharp projection projection on the stainless steel file so they have the projections which are used for cutting or snagging the tissue so these brooches are used to these are used to remove the vital pulp so these are used to loosen the debris in the necrotic canal and also to remove the paper points or if any cotton pellets are stick onto the canal so these are used now barbed there are two kind of brooches one are the barbed brooches and one are the smooth brooches so the barbed brooches are short angled and they are used for expirating the pulp so they are uh, used for taking the pulp out and loosening the debris in the in case of a necrotic canal and these smooth brooches they are smooth they are without the barbs so they are without the spikes they are made up of carbon steel and they are less like to likely to collapse in the fine canal canal and they are used to check the potency of the canal now these barbed brooches they are because they are made from a round soft stainless steel wire so these because they are made from the soft stainless steel wire so they are prone to fracture they are easily prone to fracture and the sm smooth surface are notched to form the barbs so these smooth surfaces are notched and to form these spikes or barbs that are that is making this barb weaker than any file so they are actually weaker and uh, how do we use these we take this brooch and we don't put it till the working length we actually make sure that we are making short of the apex because they are they have spikes and once they are made inserted into the canal and they are rotated to the 60 degrees and they engage the fibrous tissue and then they are withdrawn so there is a, the action is like we are inserting it rotating it and taking it out but what happens if the tissue doesn't come out then the we can scrub the brooch inside the wall see what happens if the pulp is not coming out then we can scrub it or rub it along the wall so this way it can come but again because these are made from the soft stainless steel wire so they can stick on the dentinal wall and once these spikes get stick on the dent dentinal wall there are high chances that the brooch may fracture then it going to be a trouble for us and to cope up with that it should not be used in the filing motion so it should be used in the reaming motion and because they are most likely to break easily they are most likely to bind to the canal so they should not be used until the canal in enlarged up to 25 or 30 number k file so first of all we should file and once we have enlarged the canal then and only then we can use these barbed brooches so first the k file is used to extract the pulp and then when the when it is flexible enough to follow the root canal then this stiff instrument then this barbed brooches should be inserted in order to extract the canal so this is about the barbed brooches so if you remember the cross section we have already covered the k file k reamer has a triangular cross section and k file has a square cross section while on the other hand h file has a square cross section and also these barbed brooches are also the square cross section with the spikes 
so these are like this with the spikes into it and the same way the rasp also looks like the same thing so this is about the brooches and if you feel that you have learned something new today then go ahead and hit the comment box and the like button because this helped me to help you skyrocket your career and knowledge while you stay at home with your family